think I, I think I might have a fucking problem. Pushing out of rolling marijuana. Thinking about getting more to the bank, but they won't let me in cause I smell like dang. I think I might have a motherfucking problem. I think I might have a motherfucking problem. YouTube, what it be like? It's your boy Fo, man. We on that NBA 2K17, and bro, I really yeah, don't know how I feel about this shit. Shout out to Stay the Goat, bro. I'm gonna link y'all to this video straight up. I got to. Man, when I tell you this shit is game breaking, bro, this glitch is crazy. And man, I'm gonna show y'all two builds that I think um would do very well with this although i'm sure like you y'all gonna come up with a whole bunch of y'all own shit now as you can see on screen i got a 611 stretch big that i just made and bro first of all look you know they can't handle this motherfucker can handle like a guard dog look i'm able to put all of the elite dribble moves that i want to put on this player as you can see me flipping through multiples um depends on the ones you buy i can put these on a stretch big now this shit is ridiculous now this is no different from the 98 98 overall glitch they cannot legally if you spend vc on this shit it's a loophole bro it's just shit that they fucked up on that they're gonna have to patch so I would just suggest you jump on the wave, bro. They not gonna take it from you, but they probably not. They probably not gonna have this shit open long, cause now it's starting to get out on YouTube where motherfuckers starting to know about it. And when too many people know about this shit, man, they gonna for show patch this, bro, cause they don't want, bro. You don't want to stretch big handling like this. What the fuck? You see this shit? Look at this. Look at the crossover the stretch big doing, bro. So think about how much space you're gonna be able to create by being able to dribble the basketball now. It's ridiculous. And then look here, um, as you can see, I can put all of the contact dunks on him if I want it. And as you see, I got DeMar DeRozan dunk package on this dude, which is insane, bro. Tell me that's not crazy. So now what you're looking at is you got a, a stretch big that can handle like a guard and he dunking like a fucking slasher. Now he ain't dunking exactly like a slasher because here's where it is nuance, bro. Um, it's still boiled down to your attributes just to keep it all the way 100. That's why I didn't even put no contact dunks on him. I'm probably gonna go in and still put like big man contact dunks on him. I might put a couple on there, but real shit, Check this out, because I've seen people comment and talking about, bro, I'm going to put a, a contact dunks on a playmaker, and I'm going to be banging on everybody. It don't work that way from the experience that I didn't have, and I'm going to show y'all what I mean. I use the dribbling as an example. Now, with my stretch big, I only have a 66 ball control. Now, I have to boost to a 71 with the plus 5 in order to even execute the curry dribble. So look what happens when I try to execute this curry dribble because I it's not meant for it to be on here. Yeah, I'm the boss. He just automatically just lose the fucking ball. So look at that shit. Now if I go into a game where I got the plus five boost, I'm able to do this shit. But in my court, as you can see, I just automatically lose it. I can't execute it. But I can still do all the other shit. You know what I mean? Like look at the crossover. Boom. This is a fucking stretch big we looking at right now, bro. Shit, it's crazy right so and i can still shoot the three man this shit is insane and i can still dunk like fucking demar DeRozan. you know what i mean like it's insane um but you know you can't you're gonna be limited so if you had like a playmaker and you put contact dunks on him man slashers will dunk at 6-3 to 6-5 they'll fucking dunk on people because they have a 60 strength bro or a 70 strength but you only have a 27 strength. You ever notice when you go into the uh, paint with a playmaker, if you make too much contact, you get knocked on the fucking floor. It's the same thing. If you ever had a slasher, cause I've had many slashers, then when I try to dunk, when I haven't boosted my strength yet, I get knocked on the floor and I can't complete the dunk. So you're gonna have a 27 strength with like a 60 something contact dunk. 
So it's not too good of an idea to put that on a, to put contact dunks on a playmaker. You could have some, bro, but it's probably gonna cause you more headache than more, more than anything, because you ain't gonna complete a lot of them fucking dunks like you think you are. Now I'm gonna show you another build of, since I was just talking about contact dunks and shit like that. Now this, to me, is probably gonna be my fucking favorite player, bro. He gonna be the funnest player, I know for sure. The stretch big is mandatory, bro. To be able to handle and dunk and still shoot the three is gonna be nasty. But you ain't gonna be like posterizing motherfuckers and nothing like that, bro. You just gonna be able, you gonna be able to get like a big tall Steph Curry type of motherfucker, man. I'm gonna show you when it low here. All right, cool. Now I build, my second build that I kinda wanna go through is gonna be a 6'10 slasher. So what's dope about this player, and I just fucking made this slasher, is y'all already know the problem with slashers is is once they get past 6-8, you can't get any of the dribble moves no more. So as you can see, I done already loaded him up with all of the fucking handles, bro. He got all of the dribble moves. So now you're going to have a big 6-10 ass slasher. Um, and you know, bro, 6-5s be catching bodies. <laughs> so think about this shit. Bro, I got a 94 standing dunk. 92 driving dunk, 90 contact dunk. You put a plus five on all that shit, that's 99, 97, and 95 respectively. And I got all four contact dunk packages, bro. 610 moving like that, able to jump out the gym. You put a plus five, you got an 81 vertical. Like in 610, bro, 76 speed with the boost. He gonna have a 70 strength with the boost. And then 77 ball control so you know he can handle. Bro, he gonna catch so many fucking bodies. It's gonna be insane, bro. This is by far has to be the demigod. And then you're off the dribble three boost all the way up to a 74. So it'll be a 79 with the boost. So you gonna be able to confidently shoot threes bang on the motherfucker snag because you you got a 610 bro like it's ridiculous this is by far gonna be the best build so it's gonna be a 610 longest wingspan 235 pounds bro so you can at least have a 90s you don't want to let that shit slip into the uh the 80s bro i let i like to have it at least a 90 i could have got it a 94 but i would have been a little bit slower and i wanted to get the speed so anyway, bro, that's all I wanted to share with y'all. I'm going to put the link in the description on how you do the shit. But definitely make this slasher build, bro. And I would definitely make the 611 stretch big because you're going to be blowing by motherfuckers, especially them big tall ass seven threes and all of that shit. And you're going to match up with a lot of them and you're going to be able to just deal with them, bro, with all those dribble moves that you're going to be able to pull off. You'll be able to pull that Kobe size up. You'll be able to pull the Jamal Crawford size up if you build him at the 611 and put his weight all the way down, longest wingspan, bro. So anyway, that's it. Like, comment if you have any questions at all about what the fuck is going on. And I hope all of y'all jump on this shit before it gets patched, man. Ride that wave. And as always, respect the OG. Peace.